thought about have thought already uh, have thought already about privacy on Facebook on your profile. Two, three. Okay, sucks. So you know. So now we need just a volunteer to give us her Facebook name. Just could be you to check something. Yeah? Okay. Cool. Me lady. Me. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> T A L I. The second. So, if I strange, so I am a stranger, and she has a really, really good um, privacy settings because we can't see anything. Can we just see her photos? Try. Oh, oh yeah. we can see your photo. Just mm. the profile, just the profile pictures. And it's okay. It's okay. So guys. And friends, look at look at friends. The friends list. Okay. No friends nice. to show. That's, that's good. really, really good. Oh, this was just a big example. So we are focusing on why you should care about your privacy on Facebook. There are so many reasons. Could be for your job because your new boss or you know, something for him can, could check your profile if he's, if he's public or not. For safety, you have to be safe for, from stalkers, for example. Uh, for cyberbullying, because a lot of bad people can use your pictures or your publications, your your news just against you. And that's why you should care about it. After an accurate sur survey in embassy school, we noticed that almost 100% uh, of students has Facebook, of course. And we, um, we tried to check how many of them really cares about privacy. And so we focused on pictures, publications, friends list, and who can add you as a friend. So, oh. Three main points. One, every, almost everybody uses Facebook. That's why it's a big deal. Second, you should care about your privacy on Facebook. Once you care about your privacy on the real life, you, you must, you have to care about your privacy on the uh, cyber life. And the third main point is, uh, after the, our, our search, we figured out that a lot of people uh, had have a, a good profile, a privacy profile. However, they do, didn't think about it. They haven't thought much about it. Which so, <coughs> as I told you before, we focused on publications, pictures, friends list, and who can have you as a friend. Starting with publication, who can see your publications? Well, you know, publications could be a status. Um, a song shared from YouTube or just a, a link. And publications are usually a way to express our agreement or di disagreement about something. Could be um, work, could, could be your job, could be the political situation, could be love, could be everything. But you have to be careful. For example, if you had a bad day at work because your boss just made you upset, and just to purge yourself, you put on Facebook, Fuck the boss. If your uh, privacy settings are not well set, maybe your boss could see it. Maybe some some of your colleagues could see it, and you you could be fired. So that's why you have to be careful about your publications, status, songs, and all. And we noticed that the 60% of uh, embassy students really cares about this. Um, most of them shows their publications just to friends. Just the 20% of them allow the friends of friends to see their publications. And just 9% uh, just don't care about it. So their profile is totally public. 
And that's about publications. Now, Julio will talk us about uh, pictures. So, <clears throat> about pictures. It's almost, it's a, a publication. However, it's really important because with pictures you can share, you, you, maybe your friends are beside you or pictures tell more than a thousand words, right? So you really don't want a picture, a bad picture going to the wrong hands. As Lucas said, for jobs, your boss, for your girlfriend maybe, or for, I don't know, your son, <laughs> could be a lot of things. I think this is a good data actually, because for most of them, most of our interviewers uh, just have friends as the who can see the, the pictures. So this is a good profile of safety. And well, as you can see, almost 10%, less than 20% friends of friends, and less than 10% is public. And well, this is good. And also, it's good because. No one, everybody knows that how it's set up. So this part is really important because you have to care about it. Which goes to the next. Then the next main point right. is right. the friends list. So some people just don't care about it, but your friends list sometimes could be a weapon that a bad person can use against you. So in my case, a few years ago, I had some problems because of my friends list. I had some troubles with a girl who tried to um, to damage me. So she just checked all my friends list, and she added a lot of my friends with a fake profile just to um, to talk like bad things about me. And uh, she tried to ruin my life, something like that. And that's why you you have to be careful about your friends list because nobody, everyone could could use it against you. In this case, just thirty percent of people uh, had a good have a good uh, uh, privacy setting about friends list. Most of them don't care about it. Well, not, not most of them, but almost most of them. Uh, less than 10%, they just don't know how to set up. And uh, yeah, another 10% uh, shows the friends list to, to everyone. Another t important topic is who can add you as a friend on Facebook? It can sound not so important, like oh, what? What does it matter? But it depends on your job. You know, if you are, you have an important job, maybe on UN or any place like this, you, you should care about it because, as you say, uh, if everybody can add you, uh, the whole world can add you, right? So. Uh, for example, yesterday I just received a solicitation on Facebook, and uh, a woman, a woman, uh, she before that she she sent me, oh, can I add you as a friend? But she didn't have any friends in common with me, and of course I didn't accept it because of what? That's just strange. So th this is usual. It's the most. It's the highest. You can see, but it's usual. Uh, almost everybody, everyone can, everyone can add. But if you have a important job or thing like that, you should consider about it. And now we are going to show you quickly, of course, how to set up your uh, yeah good privacy settings. So I will use my my profile. <coughs> For your privacy settings, you just have to click here. You can have a checkup too, just to see 
how people can see your profile. But here, who can see my stuff? Just put friends. It's easy. Because uh, the main setting is public. That's why, that's what Mark Zuckerberg wants, I think. But just put friends. Who can, who can contact me? Basic filtering is recommended. And friend request, just friends of friends, not everyone, because it could be dangerous. And how do I stop someone from bothering me? You just put the name and you block it. So guys, you just have to be careful and everything will be okay. Thank you for your attention. Have a good day.